Hi, my name is Katie Crest Irby and I'm the assistant at Columbia University. I'm joined by Liz Kittleman Jackson, who's the head coach at Columbia University, and Caitlin Jackson with Game Day Lacrosse. I'm gonna to talk to you a little bit about some other options in terms of partner passing and passing drills. So you have your typical drill where you have two people and they're just passing back and forth. But lacrosse rarely ever takes place standing still. Lacrosse is a game on the move and so we really need to work on our skills where we're moving and catching and doing the fundamental fundamentals on the move. So one drill you can do within your partner passing is just this partner passing on the move. So this would be as if Liz and Caitlin were running up the field, passing back and forth, and really working on those fundamental, fundamental skills while on the move. Another drill that you could do is within your partner passing kind of format. Okay, Liz would cut away from the ball, then she would cut back to cradle, come back away. Okay, really working on some dynamic catching and throwing. And this is all, this all can be done with just two people partner passing back and forth. These are some good alternatives to just your simple on the move standing partner passing. Again, lacrosse takes place on the move. So you want to be able to nail the fundamentals while running forward and moving up and down the field. We never on the field are standing still. And so this is why some of these other options for partner passing drills are really important to add into your game.